Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. Collecting and paying sales tax can be complicated for some companies. For example, a company may have to collect and pay more than one sales tax. Many companies have a mix of taxable and non-taxable products and services to sell, and many also have some customers that are taxable while other customers are not. In QuickBooks, you can apply sales tax on selected items for taxable customers during the sales process. It also keeps track of how much sales tax is collected and for which taxing agencies the sales tax is collected. From this information, QuickBooks can then create the check or checks for the appropriate tax agency or agencies when the sales tax is collected or due. However, to use QuickBooks to track and pay sales tax, you must perform the following steps. We will examine each part of this process in detail later to help you set up your company to track and pay sales tax. So first you must set up sales tax agencies, sales tax items, and sales tax groups if needed. In the vendors list, you create the sales tax agencies to whom you submit the sales taxes that are collected. In the item list, you create the separate tax rates you need to charge for each sales tax collected as sales tax items. If needed, you also create sales tax groups that assess a set of sales taxes on sales in each district for which you collect and report sales tax. After that, you need to indicate your taxable and non-taxable customers and items. So in your item and customer job lists, you need to indicate which items and customers are taxable or non-taxable. Then assign sales tax rates or sales tax groups to your taxable customers. You then apply tax to taxable sales. When you create an invoice or a sales receipt that includes taxable items for a taxable customer, QuickBooks calculates, collects, and tracks the sales tax automatically. After that, you need to find out what you owe. So as taxable sales are recorded, QuickBooks keeps track of the sales tax collected in the sales tax payable account. When it comes time to pay a sales tax agency, you can open the sales tax payable register to see how much is owed, or you can create a sales tax liability report. Finally, you need to pay your tax agencies. In the Pay Sales Tax window, QuickBooks shows the sales tax owed and creates the check or checks to the tax agency or agencies for the amount or amounts that are collected. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.